When open source intelligence confirms that the radar cross section area of the KJ3000 AWACS is 60% lower than that of the Y20B, a central strategic question emerges. How does China achieve the stealthy transformation of its strategic AWACS platforms and has its plasma stealth technology and distributed aperture radar system broken through the double shackles of the traditional AWACS in terms of electromagnetic exposure and manoeuvre lag? The answer to this question may be reshaping the underlying logic of modern air combat as the world's first strategic early warning aircraft with stealth characteristics, KJ3000 engineering breakthroughs. Far beyond the fuselage surface of the rhombic shape and wave-absorbing coatings, the back of the aircraft bulging conformal radome inside 1,280 gallium arsenide T, are components of the digital array, is a quantum noise level of the signal characteristics of the implementation of the scanning, this will be the this paradoxical unity of active detection and passive concealment is precisely revealing the paradigm revolution. In the history of AWACS development, China's new KJ3000 AWACS has not only completed its post-first flight technical validation ahead of schedule, but has also achieved a stunning breakthrough in its power system. Thermal imaging photos provided by an anonymous defense contractor show the turbofan engine, suspended under its wings with an unusually wide culvert ratio, which is completely at odds with the typical characteristics of the Russian-made D30KP2 engine. When a researcher at a think tank fed the image into a parameter comparison system, the computer gave a 92.7% probability of a match within 0.3 seconds. It was none other than the WS-20 high-bypass turbofan engine, which has been under secret development by the China Aviation Industry Corporation for more than a decade. This maximum thrust of 14.5 tons of China's heart completely rewrite the performance of early warning aircraft boundaries. Compared to its Russian engine-dependent predecessor, the WS-20 brings not only a 25% increase in range, but also a 300% increase in power supply for onboard equipment thanks to its innovative design of a dual-axis permanent magnet generator. This explains why the KJ3000 is able to integrate up to 12 phased array radar units of different frequency bands while maintaining the original aerodynamic layout of the transport aircraft. Simulations by a defense research institute in Tokyo have shown that when the aircraft is cruising at an altitude of 8,000 meters, its conformal radar system can detect the F-35 up to a staggering 650 kilometers, which is equivalent to 2.3 times the range of the in-service E-3 AWACS aircraft. But what really keeps strategic analysts up at night is the system penetration power demonstrated by the KJ-3000. Through the signature of intercepted electromagnetic signals, an Australian electronic reconnaissance station found that the aircraft had simultaneously guided 48 air targets during a certain exercise, a number that corresponds precisely to the size of the J-20B fleet of a brigade of the PLAS Eastern Theater Aviation Corps. What's even more bizarre is that the interval between the generation of all tactical commands remained within 0.8 seconds, a reaction speed that exceeds the limits of human operation confirming the speculation of the International Institute for Strategic Studies in London that China has implanted a neuromorphic computing chip into the early warning aircraft's charging system. When the U.S. Naval War College's wargaming exercise introduced these parameters, the collapse of the traditional air defense circle in the Western Pacific was 72 hours earlier than expected. The deeper logic of this silent revolution may be hidden in the trajectory of China's leap in the military technology tree. According to a technical white paper, that emerged from the Zhuhai Air Show 2024, the KJ3000, SR, and D team creatively integrated quantum radar principles into traditional microwave detection and deciphered the waveform scattering characteristics of the stealth coating through quantum state preparation technology. This technology path, referred to as quantum gaze, enabled the aircraft to successfully lock onto a J-35 carrier-based aircraft carrying out ultra-low altitude surprise defense 320 kilometers away during a confrontation exercise in the East China Sea, a distance sufficient to allow the Red Flag 9, B anti aircraft missile to complete three intercept calculations. When the eyes turn to the butterfly change of the power system, the engineering miracle of the WS-20 engine also reflects the qualitative change of China's aviation industry. The use of a 3D printed monolithic lobe disc and ceramic matrix composite combustion chamber design allows it to maintain 14 tons of thrust 
while reducing fuel consumption by 18% compared to the D30KP2. It's not just a numbers game. In a computer model simulating a conflict in the Taiwan Strait, the KJ3000 retrofitted with the new engine is capable of sustaining duty in a war zone for 14 hours, a critical window of 5 hours longer than the original design. More interestingly, the 32 micro sensor arrays distributed along the outer edge of the engine HL suggest that China has made a breakthrough in the field of electromagnetic stealth of aircraft, which may explain why the radar screen of the Japanese Self Defense Forces F 15J was unusually blanked out for up to 43 seconds when the aircraft crossed the Miyako Strait? In this quiet technological race, the U.S. intelligence community is caught in something of a cognitive dilemma. Testing of the KJ 3000, originally expected to be combat ready by 2027, is running 11 months ahead of the most aggressive intelligence assessments. What makes the Pentagon even more uneasy? is that open source intelligence shows that the aircraft has completed a data link test with the onboard accusation system of the Type 076 amphibious assault ship, which means that China is changing the battlefield role of the AWACS from an airborne radar station to a cross-domain command hub. A private memo from a retired U.S. admiral leaked a shocking detail in the recent red flag military exercise. The success rate of traditional SEAD tactics plummeted from 78% to 19% after Blue Force commanders were forced to introduce the assumed parameter of China's AWACS intervention. Behind this intergenerational crushing is a fundamental difference in the paradigm of military science and technology development between the United States and China. When the U.S. Air Force is still arguing over the delivery date of the E-7, Wedge Tail, early warning aircraft, China has quietly built up a two-tier early warning system of KJ-500 plus KJ-3000, the former by virtue of digital array radar technology to form a tactical node densely spread in the airspace, the latter relying on strategic platforms to occupy the heights of electromagnetic space. More deadly, through the seamless integration of the Sky Dome combat cloud system, this system is swallowing up the fog of the battlefield in every corner of the western Pacific Ocean. F-22 from the Kadena base in Okinawa. The machine learning characteristics of its training track has been marked by a Chinese artificial intelligence center as a pattern X-7. In this battle without smoke, the deepest threat may come from the quantum computer, blinking in the cockpit of the KJ-3000. Measured by satellite imagery, a Canadian think tank has found that the aircraft's head fairing is 37% larger than that of the Yun 20B prototype, a space large enough to accommodate more than three photonic computing modules. Combined with China's frequent quantum communication tests at the Taiwan Satellite Launch Center, a horrific operational picture is emerging. The KJ3000, equipped with a quantum radar, could be weaving an unbreakable command network covering the first island chain turning any stealthy fighters entering the area into transparent targets. While the Pentagon's China military power report still describes its adversary in terms of incremental improvements, the KJ-3000 is a strategic wake-up call. This stratospheric eye of China has not only redefined the rules of modern air warfare, but has also shaken the balance of power on both sides of the Pacific Ocean at a deeper level. The clouds of trails trailing from its wingtips may be writing the first chapter of the military revolution of the 21st century, and the world has only just turned the page.